we had an early start Thursday morning as we watched some of the Marine recruits routine physical fitness training. Um, we call it crawl, walk, run. So you're not expected to come into Paris Island being able to run three miles under 25 minutes. They get you there and it's all a process. The early morning runs and push-ups are just some of the many physically and mentally challenging hurdles recruits must endure. We had the chance to put those hurdles to the test ourselves. We started on the confidence course. Stop, making me nervous. This course tests recruits strengths and weaknesses while building their character. They get to experience a couple obstacles and challenge themselves and see if they have what it takes or if they could have had uh, what it takes if they were a little bit younger. Part of the course is martial arts training. There, we learned some basic stances and punches. The next task is the rappel wall, which was created for the recruits to be able to push themselves and face their fears. Most of the teachers took the leap and rappelled down the 47.8 foot tall wall. I'm extremely afraid of heights. I walked up there, like legs shaking, and the Marine looks at me and says, are you all right? I said, no, but I'm gonna do it anyways. But I didn't touch the wall after I got about a quarter of the way down. I just straight down. I was like, nope, get me on the ground. <laughs> I, on the other hand, <laughs> did not. What is your excuse? Huh? I did. I, I couldn't do it. Your boss is not even mad at her, bro. After the more physically demanding obstacles, it was time for something a little more intimidating, the gas chamber. They told us, they said, hey, you're going to feel the burn a little bit when you walk in and obviously that was a huge understatement. It immediately set my face and eyes on fire and so I walk out and I'm crying. I'm going to not recommend the uh, gas chamber. Forest County Agricultural High School teachers Denver Taylor and Stephen Miller say that the educators workshop has been a real eye-opener as to what people must go through to become a Marine. It's unbelievable. Um, and, and to know that every Marine goes through that. And, mm -hmm. and it, it's just been so humbling, uh, the fact that somebody would go through all of that just for the opportunity to protect us. Right. And I would tell any educator, if they had the opportunity to do it, they need to jump on it. Because I think this is something that you're hardly, very few people get the opportunity to even see yeah. in this, in this uh, country. And I think that you can actually gain a lot more for your personal benefit as well as your students benefit. In Paris Island, Carly Blake, WDAM on your side.